Welcome back. So in this video, we are going to see how to make objects public. Let's see that uh, we want to, uh, in the last video, by the end, when we clicked on it, we had no access. Now, if we try to go and in the permissions, there is the read and write, where is the object actions and we need to see make public when we click on it it's saying is blocked because of the setting let's see what happens the red fail so we are unable to make this object this picture publicly accessible so we're going to exit out of here we're going to go back to s3 bucket information in the bucket we're going to go to permission and here we can uncheck this we can add it and we're gonna block so we are allowing full access to this bucket but with a catch we're gonna write confirm first to confirm that we are making this bucket public but now if we go back to objects we click on <clears throat> let's say 37 click on this still unable to access let me refresh it just in case you're wondering if it's a, a latency issue i have uh, refreshed it three times and we are still not able to access reason being is that we made the bucket public but the objects inside are still not public uh, let me show you if we go to what is the bucket mm, right there bucket uh, actions okay it's missing maybe columns <clears throat> size e tags cancel okay so what's happening here is that I just wanted to show you on the screen but basically what's happening is we made the bucket public but we did not make these um, files public they still have inherited their permissions and they are not public so we, all we have to do is just go again uh, we can go from here object actions we can click on make public or if I go back I could click uh, like if there were multiple files that I'm going to make public I could check all, uh, all of them and then through the action I could make public and if I click make public now I have the green bar visit view details below and if I go to this file and click on its public URL now I can see my uh, my picture this is outside uh, uh, my home and you can see that uh, uh, we are able to access this file now while before we were not able to but uh, what will happen if I go back to my bucket and objects and I click on 49 49 right here I am unable to access it so here comes the problem let's upload two more videos oh sorry what happened here under close tab okay so what happens if I go back let's try to upload two more files and see if we are able to access them I'm gonna go to s3 bucket upload and add files and let's create these two uh, websites uh, web pages that I created we can uh, this is disable versioning we will uh, come back to versioning in a later video uh, let's see I have uploaded these two and I want to see if I'm able to access this file or not access denied so we have we have come to a problem the problem is that I have a bucket that has public access but whatever object I uploaded prior to making making it public or afterwards they are 
not publicly accessible and I have to go and make it public so imagine if you have a bucket that uh, the whole HR department or finance department or IT department is using and there are like maybe 10 15 50 or maybe a thousand users uploading their files but none of them are able to publicly access it are you or an admin or a group of admins will be there to always going and after those files and making them public that will be pretty hectic that's we're gonna tackle in the next video if this video has helped you please rate comment subscribe and share and i see you in the next one